I was very relieved to hear what Desiree had to say. Apology or not, we still needed to uh, address the issues from the day before and that morning for that matter. So Adam had uh, already devised his punishment. Basically, since you came in here, you've been back talking, you've been disrespectful, cussing, and so. You have stuff to wear for outside? So for your punishment today, what happens is, is all these rocks that are on the dirt, mm -hmm. they can injure our horse's feet. There's really no good way to do it other than by hand. Oh. This is gonna take forever. I just felt it was a task that would potentially deter her from defying us in the future. She didn't seem like a kind of girl who'd like to go out and get dirty. You know, and hopefully there isn't any more you know, reasons to have any more punishments, but the next one's probably gonna involve the manure pile over there. Sayonara. Have fun. I'll try my best. Adam gave me my chore and I took it. I went outside and I did it. And he went inside and they all ate lunch and left me outside raking up the rocks. I cannot believe I have to do this. It's so pointless. I looked outside a couple times. She wasn't happy. You know, she wasn't doing it very positively. Ugh. There's rocks everywhere. <laughs> oh my god. First I felt abandoned, but. Need some help? Yeah. The two little boys came out and helped me, and so did Adam. We're gonna finish this thing up. It's looking pretty close. Let's start wrapping this up here. All right. Well, you did a good job, Desiree. It looks good. I'm really looking forward to getting to know Desiree more and, you know, making a positive impact on her life. <laughs>